celebrities and royalty braved the scorching temperatures to enjoy the festivities on Ladies' Day, as the sun shone down on the suited and booted racegoers. Once again there were plenty of famous faces on show from a former Queen of the Jungle to Good Morning Britain stars as they enjoyed another sun-soaked race day. Emma celebrity winner Georgia Toffolo was in a joyful mood as she laughed along with photographers. On a day when headwear could take up plenty of airspace, Toff decided to opt for a small beret and let her shoulders do the talking as she wore a striking golden dress with puffy sleeves. Good Morning Britain presenter Charlotte Hawkins, who is a regular at the Big Race meets, was a little more demure with a pale blue dress and matching hat. Former This Morning host Eamon Holmes put his backhoes out of his mind so that he could enjoy a second day at Ascot. He once again looked resplendent in top hat and tails, while fashion influencer Hannah Cross, who has previously dated Brooklyn Beckham and Kourtney Kardashian's ex, Scott Disick, cut a dashing figure in a white, patterned dress. DIY SOS star Nick Knowles was smiling from ear to ear as he stepped out with girlfriend Katie Dodsey, as the pair looked loved up on arrival for Ladies' Day. Sky Sports and GB News presenter Kirsty Gallagher was back in black for the day with a dress that accentuated her svelte figure. Meanwhile, chart-topping singer Mabel made brown and gold the color of the day with a spectacular pointed golden headpiece. Jeremy Ka was another that took advantage of the glorious weather by stepping out with wife Victoria, who he married last year after their wedding was postponed six times during the coronavirus pandemic. On the royal front, Zara Tindall looked sensational as she attended the prestigious race day, as her grandmother the Queen was absent from proceedings. She wore a white gown for the carriage ride across the racecourse, entering the exclusive royal enclosure with her husband Mike Tyndall. The mom of two wore a white dress with red buttons, which shone in the glorious sunshine in Berkshire, and she was seated next to her mother, Princess Anne. Also at the race event was Rob Rinder, who looked dapper in his top hat and tails alongside a female companion. Celebrity chef James Martin could be seen enjoying the horse racing, and was with a mystery female guest, who looked stunning in a blue fitted gown. The annual event, which takes place in Berkshire, attracts well dressed celebrities and royalty, and this year was no exception. Celebrities have been attending the Ask at Trace event this week, with Holly Willoughby. Ma Yajama and Dame Deborah James all taking part in the festivities. Earlier this week, this morning presenter Holly looked sensational in a pink midi dress by Susanna London, teamed with a floral Philip Tracy fascinator and nude heels. Ma Yajama stole the show in a floor-length gown by Australian brand Zimmerman, which featured opulent ruffles emblazoned with pink and red flowers. She teamed the dress with an extravagant matching headpiece, and gold heels. Dame Deborah James was among the revelers in the royal enclosure at the prestigious racecourse, and looked stunning in a black and white polka dot dress, as she attended with her brother Ben, who looked dapper in a top hat and tails. Dermot O'Leary was also suited and booted for the royal occasion, and he looked handsome in a grey suit, while his director wife D. Kopeng O'Leary rocked a chic monochrome patterned dress, teamed with a black blazer and gorgeous fascinator. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. Co.2Core or call us direct 0207 29